Are we live? I think we're live, guys. Hello, hello. Welcome, welcome. Guys, it's been a hot minute. It's been a while since my last live. Hello, hello. Happy Monday. It is currently yeah, 21st of October, 2024, in the evening. Okay, welcome, guys. Hope you're all doing well. Okay, let's make sure, yeah, let's just do our testing. Okay, to make sure that we can hear me. Hello, J hello, Joe. Welcome, my friend. Hello, hello. Welcome, welcome, guys. Happy half term for those of you um, on half term. Okay, or happy Monday. Okay, for those of you off school or at school. Sorry. Hello, CS. Welcome, my friend. Welcome, CS. Hello, hello. Hello, CS. Welcome, my friend. Guys, let me know. Can you hear me? Let's move this down. It's not in the way. Hey, hello, Thomas. Welcome, my friend. Hello, hello. Hope you're well. Guys, in this session, we are looking at how we solve equations for GCN to a math. Okay, Iron Foundation. Hello, Jess. Welcome back, Jess. Hello, hello. Welcome, welcome. Hope you're well. Hey, thank you. Thank you for joining tonight. Hey, happy half term, guys. I hope everyone's yeah, having a good start here yeah, to half term. Yes, I remember you, Thomas. I remember you. Yes, I remember you. Okay, how are you, my friend? Hope you're doing well. Guys, know the drill. Okay, tap that screen, guys. Okay, share the live out if you can. Okay, let's see if we can try. Okay, quite ambitious. Let's see if we can try and smash. Hello, user. Welcome, my friend. Welcome, welcome. Hello. Hello, Sue. Welcome, my friend. Let's see if we can smash. Sorry. Okay. 10k likes in tonight's live. So it's currently a quarter past 11, okay, on Monday night in the UK. Okay, for, for anyone here that is rewatching it on repeat, okay, in this session, we are looking at how we solve equations. So looking at one, two, three set of equations. Hello, Diane, welcome. Hello, Samson, welcome, my friend. Okay. So we shall make a start in just two minutes, okay? If you're new here, make sure you press that follow button. Okay, tap the screen. Okay, share the live out if you can. Hello, Lucy. Welcome. Welcome, Lucy. Hello, hello. Hello, Painter. Welcome. Okay, if you're new here, guys, press that follow button. Okay. And I'm going to start to try and go live more often. Okay, obviously, it's now half term. So I'm going to try and do some lives here in the daytime here this week and next week. Okay. And then back to evening lives. Hello, account number. Welcome, my friend. Um, from the 4th of November, okay, but guys, if you're new here, make sure you press that follow button, please, okay, and check out the content on my page, and we shall make a start, okay, in two seconds. Guys, let me know, is the audio clear, guys, can you hear me? Yeah. Let me know. Can you hear me? Is everything here nice and crystal clear? And can you see the board or the screen better? Okay. Right, guys. Okay, without further ado, we shall make a start. Okay. Question number one. Write a number in each box to make the calculation Correct. Okay. So starting right at the basics, okay, and then building up, okay, to those higher tier questions. Okay. Part I. Seven plus something is twelve. Hopefully you're happy. That answer will be five. Okay. Seven plus five makes twelve. Okay. Part I. I. Eleven subtract something is three. Hello, Jack. Welcome, Jack. Hello, hello. Okay, so 11 subtract 8, guys, is equal to 3. Okay, but again, this, yeah, obviously, yeah, it's done obviously by trial and error. Okay, but there is a little system to obviously work it out. Okay, for the first part, essentially, we're going to subtract, okay, 7 on both sides. And then that blank, okay, makes 5. And then here for the second one, essentially, I'm going to, 
add blank to both sides and then subtract 3. So I have 11 minus 3 makes 8. Okay, question number 2. Solve x plus 4 equals 19. What's the opposite of adding 4? That will be to subtract 4. So minus 4 on both sides. Okay, when I do this, guys, we get x equals 19 minus 4, which is 15. Okay, if you got that, well done. Okay, if you're not sure yet, I hope it makes sense now. Okay, we're trying to isolate and get let here on its own by itself. Question number three, solve d over 2 equals 9.5. Hello, Addy, welcome, Addy. Okay, what's the opposite of divided by 2, guys? That will be to multiply by 2 on both sides, so times by 2 on both sides, because that cancels off the division, okay, on both sides. So we have d equals 9.5 times 2. So double it, okay, that would be 18 or 18.0, okay, because double 9 is 18, double 0.5 or 0 0.5 or 0 0.5 gets you 1. But again, if you're unsure, okay, think of it as 95 times 2 and then divide your answer by 10. And if you're unsure, let's work it out. 2 times 5 makes 10, so 0, carry the 1. 2 times 9 is 18, plus that 1 makes, sorry, 90, sorry, not 80, sorry, 19, so I apologise, okay? Sorry, 19, okay, not 18, I apologise, okay, that's my fault there. Should be 19, guys, yeah, not 18, okay, sorry about that, that's my fault. Sorry, I meant to say double 9 is 18, and then double point five is 1, 18 plus 1, There we go, okay, yep, yeah, thank you for that, okay, sorry about that, yep, that, you're right, yep. Thank you, okay. How have you managed that? I think it was, just, yeah, it was just a mistake, I apologize, okay. Question number four. So solve 7y equals 63. So in the chat, guys, what is the value of y? Okay. So what does 7y mean? And what's the opposite? Okay, Ellis got an answer. Yep. Okay, Ellis got an answer. Okay, anyone else got an answer? Thank you for the likes. So, yeah, thank you for the likes. Okay, keep them coming. Okay, spot on, Shabs. Yep. So, 7y means 7 times y. The opposite is divide by 7. Okay, so that's the opposite of timesing. Okay. So 63 divided by 7 is 9. So y equals 9. And that, guys, is my final answer. Okay, thank you. Thank you, Matt, for liking. Hello, Mrs. Z. Thank you. Thank you, Matt, for liking. Welcome back, my friend. Welcome back. Okay, question might be a bit more trickier. Thank you. Thank you, Shabs, for liking it. Thank you so much. Yeah, thank you, Shabs, for the follow. If you're new here, okay, press that follow button, okay? My target is to try and hit 10K followers ASAP now. Okay, ideally, my dream was to hit 10k followers here yeah, by the start of November. So TikTok can start paying me for my videos. Okay, but if not, my target is to try and reach here yeah, 10k followers here yeah, by the end of the year. Okay, realistically. But if you're new here, okay, if, you, if, you, if you're able to help me, okay, you press that follow button. Question number five. Solve 5 minus m equals 12. Step 1, okay, is I'm going to add m to both sides to make, obviously, yeah, the letter actually positive, okay? So here, guys, I'm going to get 5 equals 12 plus m, okay? The next step, I want to, yeah, get rid of this here. Plus 12 here. Okay. So 5 minus 12. 5 subtract 12. And we get minus 7. Hello, Anya. Welcome, Anya. Hello, hello. Hope you're well. Okay, so minus 7 equals M. So M equals minus 7. Again, I know it's quite easy, guys. Okay, yep, spot on a key. 
So careful, Cody. Five add 12 makes 17. Okay. You want to make the M positive. Okay. So just do five, subtract 12. Okay. And then we get minus seven. Okay. We can try and do great. Yeah, obviously, at some point, yeah, at some point, yeah, forget chance. Okay. So the later questions will be. Grade five, okay. So question six, okay. So solve five G equals forty. So five G means five times G. The opposite is divide. So divide by five. Divide by five. So in the chat, please. What is forty divided by five, please? Hello, Jesse. Welcome. Hello, Sally B. Welcome. Hello, Noah. Welcome. Yep, Cody's got an answer. Yep, he's got an answer. Okay, well done, guys. Yep. So the answer is eight. Okay, five lots of eight. Okay, well done, Anya. Yeah, yep, spot on, Anya. Okay, make start. Right, next one. Okay, so slightly more tricky. Okay, so this is now the crossover of higher and foundation. Okay, so solve four brackets. Okay, a minus three equals 22. Hello, user. Welcome, user. Okay, Alice, yep, more than Alice, yep, spot on. Alice, yep, spot on. Okay. So step one, I'm going to expand the brackets. So four times A makes four A. And then four times minus three makes minus 12. That's going to be equal to 22. I'm now going to add 12. To both sides, okay, to balance each side, yeah, respectively, okay. So you have 4a equals 34. What's the opposite of times, you guys? That'll be to divide, okay, divide by 4 on both sides, okay, half it and then half it again, or half it and then half it again. So that'll be 17 over 2. Okay. If I want to, I can write it as 8.5. Either answer would suffice. Again, my advice is leave it as a fraction if you can. Okay, thank you. Thank you, guys, for all the follows. Yeah, thank you for the, all the follows, guys. Thank you so much for all the follows. Guys, if you're new here, okay, make sure you hit that follow button, okay? Oops, sorry, guys, I apologize. Okay. Question eight, okay, step one, okay, expand the bracket, so do five times x, five times minus six, five times x makes five x, okay, five times minus six makes minus 30, sorry guys, about my new actually pad, yeah, I've got like a new pad, it's been a bit funny, I apologize, okay. So user's got an answer. Okay, let's just double check user's got an answer. Okay, that's equal to 65. I'm now going to add 30 to both sides to balance each side here respectively. Okay. So you have 5x equals 65 plus 30 without being, uh, sorry, 5x, sorry, 5x equals, yeah, 95. So 5x means 5 times x. Hello, TikTok. Welcome, my friend. Hello, hello. Okay, 5 times x, okay, so that'll be 95. Dividing here yeah, by Fabian on both sides. Hello, Halima, welcome, Halima. Hello, hello. Hello, Joe's Maria, welcome. Hello, hello. Welcome, guys. Welcome, welcome. Okay, so 95 divided by 5. Okay, and I get 19. Okay, again, if you're unsure, Let's do a little bust up here to the side. Okay. So fives into nine go once, with the remainder of four. Fives into 45 go nine times. So that, guys, is my answer. Okay, thank you. Thank you, Dummy, for the follow. Okay, thank you, Dummy Ray, for the follow. Thank you. Th thank you for the likes, guys. Thank you for the likes, okay? So Thomas has got an answer here for the next one. Okay, let's double check. Okay, solve 
8 bracket m minus 5 yeah, equals 48. Okay, so expand the okay, case, so expand the bracket out. You have 8m. Oops, sorry, guys, that's my fault. Sorry about that. Okay, it's my fault. Let's just make it into a red. And I have 8m. Okay, minus 40. Oops, sorry, guys, this is my fault. This new pad is being cut off in the case. Sorry about this new pad. Okay. Is equal to 48. Okay. Add 40 to both sides and then divide by 8. You have M is equal to 48 plus 40 all over 8. Okay. So I'll be 88 8. So 88 over 8. So 88 divided by 8, which is 11. Okay. So that is solving the equation with brackets. Okay. And that can appear on higher foundation. Okay. So question, yeah. So question 7, 8, and 9 can appear on higher and foundation. Okay, questions one to six, I would say, yeah, it's foundation only. Okay. Yeah, okay, question number 10. Okay. Hello, Anima, welcome, Anima. Hello, hello. Part A, solve X plus seven equals 13. So in the chat, hello, Dora, welcome back, Dora. Hello, hello, Dora. Hello, Holmes, welcome, my friend. Okay, so in the chat, guys, what is the value of X for part A, please? A. So write it in the chat. So something plus 7 equals 13. So what is that something, K? So this, Holmes, this is solving equations, K. Solving 1, 2, and 3 step. K, linear equations, K. So Karen's got an answer. K, Leo's got an answer. Hello, Adam. Welcome, Adam. Okay, so subtract 7 on both sides. 13 minus 7 is 6. So x equals 6. Okay, if you got that, well done. Part B, solve 3h minus 5 equals 12. So I'm going to add 5, okay, to both sides. Hello, Izzy, welcome. Thank you. Thank you. Thank, thank you so much. Thank you, user, for the follow. Okay. Okay, more than, Leo, more than Leo. Okay, spot on, Leo. So you have 3H. Oops, sorry, guys. I apologize about that. My new pad has been a bit funny. Okay, sorry about this. I apologize, Kate. Okay. It's quite sensitive on my fingers. Okay. So, Yusuf, this is more for GC maths here, but it's still relevant for key stage three maths as well. 3H means 3 times H. Divide by 3 on both sides. Okay, we get H equals 17 thirds over 3. Okay, and again, leave your answer as a fraction. That would also suffice. Okay, All right, next one, guys. Okay, part A. Hello, Jay. Welcome. Hello, Sohail. Welcome, my friend. Hello, Michael. 11A, X plus X plus X equals 42. So solve X plus X plus X equals 42. Well, x plus x plus, hello, Charlie. Welcome, Charlie. Thank you. Thank you, Figo, for liking. If you have 3x equals 42, divide by 3 on both sides, we get x equals 42 divided by 3, which is 14. Again, if you're not sure, let's work out to the side. 42 divided by 3. So threes into four go once with the remainder of one. 
threes and twelve. Hello, Helena. Welcome, Helena. No, hello. So threes and twelve. Yeah, go four times. So that's fourteen. Okay. Part B. Well then, yeah. Well then, figure. Okay. Spot on. Okay. Okay, Holmes. No worries. Okay, GS. Yeah, so GS has got an answer. Okay, well then, GS. Hello, Leah. Welcome, Leah. Okay. So next one, guys. We have y divided by three is four. So y of three yeah, is four. What's the opposite of division? That'd be to times. So times it by three on both sides. Again, to balance. It's only my equation respectively. Y equals four times three, which is twelve. Okay, you got that? Yeah, well done. Part C. Yes, Yusuf, yeah. So this can be. So this is aimed at yeah. For the foundation here, yeah, but it's appropriate for higher and foundation. This is revising the key concepts for solving yeah, equations. Okay, some are foundation tier only, but the techniques in this live, okay, in this session, okay, is revising yeah, your knowledge yeah, of how to solve equations. So this is appropriate for year seven, year eight, year nine, year 10, year 11. Okay, or anyone that is revisiting, yeah, the algebra part of the course for solving equations, yeah, for GC and to our maths. Okay, so yes, yeah, some questions here yeah, are financial tier only, but this is all relevant, okay, for both years, okay, especially, yeah, okay, looking at, yeah, some harder ones, yeah, either, yeah, in today's session or in tomorrow's session. Oh, yeah, okay, or next week, yeah, to solve. 2a minus yeah 5 equals 19 so i'm going to add 5 here to both sides okay so you have 2a is equal to 24 i don't want 2a i just want a so i'm going to divide it by 2 on both sides to balance each side here respectively hello will welcome will so a equals 24 divided by Hello, A. Hello, Absma. Welcome, welcome. Which is 12, okay? Uh, figure, yes, I can. Yeah, at some point, yeah, okay. So, yeah, I'll, I'll take your topic request, yeah, okay, for the next session, yeah, okay, uh, at the end of the, the live today. Thank you, thank, thank you, Dan, for the share. Thank you, thank you, Anya, for the share. Okay, question 12. Solve three brackets, B minus five, brackets closed. Hello, Kieran, equals 27. Okay, so step one, yeah, okay, expand the bracket. So three times B makes three B. Three times minus five makes minus 15. Hello, Ollie, welcome. Okay, equals 27. I'm going to add 15 here yeah, to both sides. Don't worry, Figo. Okay, so Figo, we are going to be covering your harder content soon. Okay, but my focus now. Is I'm trying to help out and cater for all levels, okay? So I'm trying to cover higher and foundation, okay? I know this is quite easy, obviously, for some, okay? If it's too easy, obviously, I'm just scrolling to you. Hello, hello, Yvonne. Welcome, welcome, Yvonne. Okay. But yeah, okay, so this is just yeah, a live... Yeah, just obviously going to be some algebra parts of the course. So MC. So this is yeah for both tiers. Okay. So question twelve can appear on both tiers. Okay. But I'm trying to cater for all levels of maths. Okay. Yes, it is, Grim. Yes, it is. Yep. It's for both tiers. Okay. Hello, Chrissy. Welcome, Chrissy. Hello, hello. Hello, Alana. Welcome, welcome. Hello, Walsh. Welcome, my friend. Don't worry, um, Figo or Fido, sorry. We are going to be covering, okay, harder content, okay, soon, okay, I promise you, okay. We are going to cover, yeah, some grade nine, okay, content very soon. Uh, I can, yes, at some point on uh, home, sorry. Okay, yeah, I can, yep. Yeah. So 3B, sorry, yeah, so 3B, so that'll be 42. Divide by 3 on both sides. Hello, Ava, welcome, Ava. Hello, hello. Yeah, thank you, yeah, thank you, guys, yeah, for all of, yeah, for all the, like, the new follows, yeah, thank you for, the, for all the, like, the new follows. Yeah, I appreciate it, okay? 
please, please keep sharing your obviously my account. Okay. And help me reach uh, my goal this year of 10k followers. Hopefully, TikTok can pay me some small money for my videos. Okay. But yes, okay, no worries, okay, no worries. Thank you, thank you, Holmes, for following. Okay, hello, Ollie. Welcome, Ollie. Okay, I promise, guys, yeah, we are going to cover harder content soon. Okay, right now, as we approach here, the November resets, I'm trying to cater for all levels of maths. Okay, so if it's too easy, obviously, come back here at like a later date. Okay, but I promise we are, we are going to cover, okay, some harder content soon. Okay, question 13. Hey, okay, yeah, thank you. Th thank you, K, for the follow. Okay, thank you for all the follows, guys. Okay, thank you. Thank you for the follows. Okay. 13A. Solve 2x over 3 equals 6. Step 1. I don't like this little fraction here. Okay, so I'm going to times by 3 on both sides. I'm going to have 2x equals 6 times 3 here, which would be 18. So 2x equals 18. I don't want 2x, I just want x or 1x. So I'm going to divide by 3 on both sides. Okay. So 18 divided by 2 is equal to 9. Okay. What about part B? Because okay, it's so slightly more trickier. Solve 2 brackets n plus 5 here equals 15. So step on the, yeah, obviously expand it. So 2 times n makes 2n. Okay. 2 times 5 makes 10. Okay. Hello, M. Welcome, M. Hello, hello. Is equal to 15. Okay. Oh, sorry, guys. Okay, that's my fault. Okay, apologies. Sorry about that. Okay. So, hello, Adam. Welcome, Adam. Hello, hello. Oh, that doesn't actually work. There we go. Okay. I'm now going to subtract 10 on both sides. So you have 2n equals 15 minus 10, which is 5. I don't want 2n. I just want n or 1n. So divided by 2, and we get 5 over 2, or 5 halves. Or 2.5 or two and a half. But again, my advice here is to leave it here. As a mixed number key. Hello, Ames. Welcome, welcome. So Pong says simplify. Not sure yeah, which one that is for. Hello, Rio. Welcome, Rio. Hello, hello. Okay. Yep, spot on Ames key. Thank you. Thank you, Mia. Yeah, thank you, Mia, for liking. Hello, Sakura. Welcome, welcome. Okay, but yeah, two and a half, yeah, two and a half or five halves, okay, either would suffice. All right, next one, okay. Thank you, thank you, yeah, thank you, Lucy, for you. Thank you, Lucy, for liking. Hello, Gravestone, welcome, my friend. Hello, Felix. Thank you, thank you, Lucy, for liking. Hello, Ruben, welcome, my friend. Thank you, thank you, Lucy, for liking. Thank you, CS, for liking. Thank you, Ames, for liking. 14A, so solve A plus A plus A plus A. That'll be equal to 4a. So 4a is equal to 24. Divide by 4 yeah, on both sides, we get a is equal to 6. Okay. Next one, solve b minus 3 equals 4. What's the opposite of minus thing? It'd be to add. So add 3 here to both sides. b equals 4 plus 3, which is 7. Okay. Oh, that's quite a big 7 there. There we go. Okay. Hello, Flag. Welcome, my friend. Hello, hello. Next one. Solve 4C plus 6 equals 18. I'm going to subtract 6 on both sides. You have 4C is equal to 12. Divide by 4 on both sides. C equals 12 divided by 4, which is 3. 
because 4c means 4 times c. So c is equal to 3. Okay, next one. Solve 4a equals 20. Okay, divide by 4 here on both sides. Okay, a equals 20 divided by 4, which is 5. Okay, next one, okay, solve 3y plus 9 equals 24. I'm going to subtract 9 on both sides to balance here, each side here respectively. You have 3y is equal to 24 minus 9 here, which would be 15. Hello, Stefan. Welcome, Stefan. Hello, Pac-Man. Okay, divide by 3 on both sides. When I do that, guys, we get 15 divided by 3 here, which is 5. So y equals 5 is our answer. Okay, next one. So solve y over 3. Hello, Islam Adam. Welcome, my friend. Okay, hello, Tio. Y thirds minus 5 here is equal to 4. So I'm going to add 4 here to, sorry, add 5 3 here to both sides. You have y over 3, so y divided by 3 here is equal to 9. Then I'm going to times by 3 here. Okay, remember that fraction in line here means division. So y equals 9 lots of 3, 9 times 3, which is 27. Okay. Next one, guys, case is slightly more trickier now. 17a. Solve 3 equals 9 minus 4k. So step 1, I'm going to add 4k to each side. And make the letter actually positive. Okay. So you have 3 plus 4k is equal to 9. Subtract 3 on both sides. 4k is equal to 6. Divide by 4 here on both sides, we get k equals 6 quarters, which simplifies to 3 halves. Or 1.5. Either answer would suffice. Hello, Andy. Welcome, welcome. Okay. Hello, hello, love hearts. Welcome. Okay. Next one, part B. Solve D plus 3 over 4 is equal to 5. So times by 4 on both sides. Hello, Ruby. Welcome. Okay. On both sides. So when I do that, guys, okay, you have D plus 3. Okay. Is it is equal to 5 times 4, okay, which is 20, okay. So my job is to isolate, okay, yeah, and get obviously live here by itself. Then I'm going to subtract 3 on both sides. So D equals 20 minus 3, which is 17. And that, guys, is my answer to 17B. Okay, so Ruby, sorry, yeah. Ruby, so this is actually from Maths Genie, looking at solving equations for grade four and grade five. Okay, the crossover topics for higher and foundation. All right, next one, okay, so 16a. So solve 6w equals 4w plus 9. So step one, I'm going to subtract 4w on both sides. So 6w, okay, minus 4w equals 2w equals 9. Hello, SK, welcome, SK. Okay, so 2 times what makes 9? Well, I'm, I'm, I'm going to here divide by 2 on both sides. So w equals 9 over 2, okay, or 4.5 or 4 and a half. Okay, either answer would suffice, okay? Hello, Jesse. Welcome. Next one, part B. 
solve 3x plus 8 equals 2. I'm going to subtract 8 on both sides. Okay, to balance each side. Okay, respectively. So we have 3x. Okay. Equals 2 minus 8, which is minus 6. Hello, Simon. Welcome, my friend. Yeah, long time, Simon. Yeah, well, long time, Simon. Hope you're well. Hello, hello. Hope you're well. So 3x equals minus 6. I don't want 3x. I just want x. So yeah, I'm going to obviously divide by 3 on both sides. So x equals minus 6 divided by 3, which is minus 2. Okay, hello, Alex. Welcome, Alex. Thank you, thank you, thank you, SK, for liking it. Thank you, SK, for liking. 19a, okay. So solve 2p plus 24, yeah, equals 5p. Step one, I'm going to subtract 2p on both sides, okay. Getting all my letters here onto one side. So, yeah, so they're, they're just going to cancel. Oh, sorry. Okay, I'm going to let, yeah, let's just 24. Okay, so 24 is equal to um, 2p. Sorry, 3p. Sorry, let's get, sorry about that. Okay, 3p. Okay. Oh, guys, there is a little treasure box here. So thank you. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, thank you. Thanks so much yeah, for Simon for the treasure box. Okay, if you get coins, guys, please say thank you to Simon here yeah, for the treasure box. Okay. So 3p equals 24. Divide by 3 on both sides. So P equals 24 divided by 3, which is 8. Okay. So this subject is called Maths, yeah, Rahman. And it's looking at solving equations. So solving 1, 2, and 3 step linear equations okay, for GCSE Maths. Ha ha. So I was sorry, I was, sorry I, was, I was being a bit um patronizing there. Okay. Yeah. Topic so yeah, looking at solving equations. So part B, solve 24 equals four lots of 2x minus 5. So step one, yeah, you expand the brackets. So 4 times 2x, that'll be 8x. 4 times minus 5 is minus 40. Okay, that's going to be equal to 24. I'm going to add 40 to both sides to balance each side respectively. Okay, 24 plus 40 equals 64. So 64 equals 8x. 8x means 8 times x. Oh, sorry, yep, thank you, thank you, sorry, yep, thank you, thank you for that, okay. Sorry, okay. No, no, Zach, you're right, sorry about that, okay, yep, Zach, you are right. Sorry, four times minus three, it makes me see minus 20, sorry about that, okay, it's my fault. So, add 20k, add 20k. 24 plus 20 equals 64. What am I doing? Yeah, that, that that that's what I'm thinking. Oh no no yeah I know why it's real. I know why. So ignore me, key. So divide by eight is we get forty four eight equals x k. So divide top and bottom by four, and we get eleven over two or eleven halves k okay? or five point five k. And that, guys, is my final answer. Thank you, CS. Yeah, thank you for the rose, CS. Okay. 
solving equations with unknowns on both sides now okay so solve 3x plus 12 equals 5x minus 4 step one get all my x here onto one side so i'm going to take away 3x on both sides okay when i do this i get 12 okay is equal to 5x minus 3x okay which is um 2x so 2x plus 4 i'm then going to subtract 4 on both sides 12 minus 4 equals 8 so 8 is equal to 2x i don't want 2x i just want x so i'm going to divide by 2 on both sides when i do that guys we get 4 equals x or x equals 4 and that guys hello adam welcome adam and that guys is my final answer okay Thank you, A, for the follow. Okay, thank you, A, exclamation mark, for the follow. All right, next one, okay, so nearly, nearly at the end, guys, yes, okay, got a few more questions out, and then we'll finish here. Okay, on question 27. Right, solve, sorry, question 21, actually, okay. So, solve 2M minus 20 equals 10 plus 7M. Step one, I'm going to subtract 2M on both sides, because my job is to try and get all my m's onto one side so 2m minus 3 that, that goes to zero so yeah i'm left with just minus 20 is equal to 10 plus 5m now what's the opposite of adding 10 i'm going to subtract 10 on both sides okay so be careful here with my negatives okay minus 20 minus 10 is minus 30 not 30, not minus 10, yeah, okay, so minus 10, that's going to be equal to 5m, divide by 5m yeah, on both sides, so minus 30 divided by 5 is minus 6, so m is equal to minus 6, okay, hello Sarah, welcome Sarah, okay, hello, hello, okay, what you have bought some okay, spot on Sam, okay, hello George, welcome my friend, okay, Does that make sense, guys? Yeah, are there any questions? Okay, question 22. Solve 10 minus 2s equals s minus 8. And I'm going to add 2s to both sides. Okay. So I'm going to get 10 is equal to, okay, s plus 2s, which would be 3s minus 8. What's the opposite of minus 8, guys? That would be to add 8 to both sides. Okay. Hello, Abs. Welcome, Abs. Mo. Welcome, my friend. Okay. When I do this, guys, 10 plus 8 makes a si uh, 18. Okay. Divide by 3 on both sides. Okay. So 18 divided by 3 is 6. So S is equal to 6. Okay, hello, Malik. Malika. Welcome, Malika. Or Malika, sorry. So this, guys, yeah, so, yeah, sorry, this George and Tavine. So this topic now, okay, is both higher and foundation. Awesome, Sam. Yeah, awesome, Sam. Okay. Question 23. Solve 6Y. Thank you, thank you, George. Thank you, thank you so much, George, for the follow. Hello, Z. Welcome, welcome. Okay, so solve six y plus eleven equals th three minus five y. Sorry, three y plus five. Sorry. Okay, so I'm going to subtract three on both sides. Okay, so six y minus three y is equal to three y plus eleven is going to equal to five. Okay, 
I'm not going to subtract the revenue on both sides. So 3y equals 5 minus 11, which is minus 6, divided by 3, okay, divided by 3, y equals minus 6, divided by 3, okay, well done, yeah, well done, FCRE, welcome, my friend, is minus 2, so y is equal to minus 2, okay? All right, last few questions, okay, and then we'll call it a night. Okay, question 24, guys. Solve 7y plus 18 equals 2y, okay, plus 28, okay. Hello, Philip, welcome. L, have a, have a, have a made a mistake, L, sorry. Let me know, L. So 7y plus 18 yeah, equals 2y plus 28. Okay, step one, I'm going to subtract 2y on both sides. So 7y minus 2y equals 5y. 5y plus 18 equals 28. Subtract 18 on both sides yeah, and then divide by 5. Okay. So subtract 18, subtract 18. So 5y. Okay, equals 10. Okay, so divide by 5 on both sides. So y equals 10 divided by 5 which makes 2. So y is equal to 2. Right, next one. Okay, solve 2x plus 20 equals 6x, okay, minus 12. Step one, I'm going to subtract 2x on both sides. Okay. So always take away your, or add like, yeah, like, like, yeah, like, yeah, like the smallest amount. Okay. So I'm going to get 20 equals 4x minus 2x. It's going to be 6, sorry. 6 minus 2x is going to be 4x. Hello, ATX. Welcome, my friend. Welcome, ATX. Hello, hello. Okay, yeah, more than yet, yeah, more than FC Arari or Ari, sorry. Okay, let's just double check. Add 12 to, yeah, to both sides. So 20 plus 12 makes 32. Okay, so 32 is equal to 4x. Dividing by 4, yeah, on both sides. 32 divided by 4 makes 8. So x equals eight. Okay. So last two questions. Yes. So so last two questions. Yeah, and, and, and then we'll call it a night. Okay. So solve three x minus nine equals x minus eight. Step one. I'm going to subtract x on both sides. So three x minus x makes two x minus nine equals minus 8. What's the opposite of minus 9? Yeah, that'll be to add 9 to both sides. You have minus 3. We have 2x equals minus 8 plus 9, which is equal to 1. Okay. And then divide by 2 yeah, on both sides. Okay. You have x equals 1 divided by 2, which is 0 0.5 or a half. Okay, either answer would suffice. So, FC Ori, I think you did or you thought, okay, of 8 plus 9, okay. Hello, Liam. Welcome, Liam. Okay, instead of minus 8 plus 9, okay, yeah. Yeah, more than yeah. Thank you, thank you, pro. Thank you. Yep. So you thought it was eight plus nine rather than yeah minus eight. Okay, spot on. Okay, yep. No worries. Okay. Right, last one. Okay, last one for today, guys. Okay. So solve ten t subtract nineteen equals seventeen minus fourteen. I'm going to subtract seventy on both sides. 
So 10t minus 7t equals 3t minus 9 equals minus 14. You are welcome here. You are actually welcome, Mimi. Thank you. Thank you for the comment, Mimi. Thank you. Thank you, FCRE, yeah, for the flame heart. Thank you so much. Yeah, for, thank you for the gift. I'm going to add 19 here to both sides. Now, 3t equals minus 14 plus 9, sorry, plus 19, sorry, which is 5. Okay, think of it, yeah, think of it as 19 subtract 14 or minus 14, yeah. Hello, Dino. Welcome, Dino. Okay, plus 19. Okay. So 3t equals 5. Okay, divide by 3 on both sides. So t equals 5 over 3, or 5 thirds, or 1 and 1 third. Or 1.6 here reoccurring. And again, my advice here, where possible, leave your answer here or answer as a fraction. Okay. And that, guys, okay, takes us here to the end of today's session. Okay. That was, okay, solving equations. Are there any questions? Okay, hello, Liv. Welcome, Liv. Okay, thank you, Rahman, for the follow. Okay, so are there any questions, guys? Okay, so that concludes. Okay, one of our topics. Okay, thank you, thank you, J Max, here for the follow. Okay, are there any questions? Okay, so this covers both years. Okay. So the first few questions were foundation only, and then from, I would say, from question seven onwards, yeah, I would say, yeah, is a mix of higher foundation. Okay. Well, that concludes today's session here on this. Are there any questions here? Are there any questions, guys? Okay. Or if you want to, okay, drop your topic requests below. So Blake says how to expand double brackets. Okay, so I can cover that yet at some point. Okay, or shall I cover it now, Blake? Obviously, it is quite late now. So, I, shall I do one more topic, guys, or not? Shall I do one more topic? Okay, thank you, thank you, Pro. Oh, Aku, okay, yeah, for the for the raise, uh, Rose, sorry. Hello, tonight, welcome. Guys, are there any questions? Let me know. Guys, if you're new here, please, please, please press that follow button. Okay. Yeah, any topic requests, guys, okay, either yeah, let me know here, yeah, okay, in my comments below, or if you can, so Abdullah, yeah, so this is for higher and foundation, okay. I'm going to go in about like actually two minutes, guys. Okay. So, Tanar says probability. Okay. So, I can't actually cover that yet at some point. Okay. Guys, make sure you yeah, press that follow button, please. Okay. And check out the content on my videos.
eight. Guys, I'm gonna be here in like two more minutes, guys. Yeah, so two more minutes here. Yeah, I'm gonna go. So guys, yeah, make sure you press that follow button, please, if you're new here. Okay. And can we try and get to yeah, 10k before I'm going to end the live tonight? Can we try and hit 10k, guys? Before I go, okay, because that was my target. If everyone taps like mad, okay, we can get 10k in no time. Well, I've actually just actually finished here, CYT underscore six. Thank you, Tanar, for liking. Thank you, FC Ari, for liking. Thank you, CS, for liking. Thank you, Tanar, for liking. Thank you, FC, yeah, for liking. Guys, are we are we are we gonna hit it? Oh, oh no! Okay, if we can get to nine k, yeah, I'll be happy. Okay. Hello, Thea. Welcome. Oh, guys, we're so close now. We've got exactly two minutes here, and then it's going to cut off my live. Hello, Hasburn. Welcome, my friend. Or oh, Hasburn. Welcome, my friend. What a name. Hello, Ritz. Welcome, welcome. Hello, Tara. Welcome. Guys, we're so close now. Come on. We've got one minute left. Can we hit 10k? Everyone, guys, just tap that mud, okay? Those of you that, that are here, actually, just tap that mud, okay? There's now six of us here in the chat, okay? Just keep tapping. Thank you, yeah, thank you, girls, for liking. Thank you, FC Ari, for liking. Thank you, CS, for liking. Thank you, Hasban, for liking. Hello, Ali. Why am I teaching me at this time? Help, I haven't revised. Oh, sorry about that, Zainaki. Okay, sorry about that. Guys, 40 seconds, and then it's going to cut off. No! Managed to hit 9k, okay, so 9k, guys. <laughs> you want to scrap. <laughs> Good one. Right, guys, I'm calling now, actually, because I'm calling it now, okay, okay? So I shall see you all tomorrow. Oh, that's the chat, sorry. Oh, there we go. But guys, I shall catch you all soon, okay? Come on then, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Good night, ghost. Good night, my friend, okay? Good night. Come on.
Are we going to hit it, guys? Are we going to hit it? So tomorrow, I'm going to confirm times here. Okay. Um, if you're on half term, then I'll try and go live here in the morning or daytime. If you're not on half term, then I'll try and go live here. Yeah. Come on. Bang. We got it. 10K. Come on. We got it, guys. K. Thank you so much. Okay, thank you. Thank you for all the gifts. Right, guys. Good night, okay? I'll catch you all soon, okay? Enjoy your evening, okay? See you tomorrow. Okay, I'll see you soon, okay? Bye for now, okay? Thank you. Thank you for all the support. Thank you, FCRE, for liking. Thank you, Ghost, for liking. I shall see you all tomorrow, okay? Bye for now, okay? Good night.